in uh, what is gas uh can you speak it can you speak it what okay ladies and gentlemen of the star committee today i have compiled a report on why we are experiencing money problems here in SDA. I have three problems to propose to the audience on why we are experiencing these kinds of problems. Number one is the fact that we have problems in plumbing. plumbing. According to the SDA administration, um, and according to the SDA engineer, one Ilyas, as one said, that the problem in SDA is that we tend to use our money for repairing, uh, repairing pipes and also repairing uh, other plumbing materials. And he has said that oh, overall, we have two to three plumbing problems every day that needs to be solved. And each week, we have to spend almost 2,000 ringgit to spend on plumbing problems. And this is why if we multiply 2,000 weeks in a month, we have four weeks. So 2,000 times by four, we spend almost 8,000 on plumbing alone. That's the number one. Number two is the fact that we spend our money on unnecessary projects. According to the Star Administrative Board, one said that we use almost 18,000 ringgit on the uh, on the scenic view at in front of the KH, uh, in front of the living skills, uh, living skills, uh, living skills, uh, uh, living skills lab. And in front of it, we have spent 18,000 ringgit. And unfortunately, according to the Star Nature Club, one said that almost, almost zero, almost nobody ever uses the scenic view there to rest. And which is the main objective of why we created the scenic view in the first place. That's the first project, unnecessary project. The second unnecessary project that we have created is on is the pool beside the Star Gymnasium, which is used for our swimming pool team. However, in a report made by the swimming pool, one said that over a month we use 32,000 for swimming activity for the swimming pool. However, in current, in current projections made by the swimming club, we only use only two times the swimming club and with a year, which, only, which is only used during the uh, big tournaments such as the national swimming uh, race and so forth. And this is why we say that the swimming pool is an unnecessary project made by the school and which is why we are experiencing a monetary crisis. That's number two. Number three is the fact that we, we use our money to repair uh, is facilities that has been affected by vandalism. On average, <coughs> according to the Star uh, Disciplinary, <coughs> Disciplinary Board, one said that Disciplinary Board, Disciplinary Board, okay. uh, one said that we experience, uh, we have problems regarding on vandalism, where we have problems regarding on uh, these uh, the bathrooms being vandalized, where the toilet stalls. Have, uh, have holes in them which need to be repaired daily. And it's not just that. It's not just the bathroom that, being that is being vandalized, but also the dormitory, the, uh, the students' dormitory, where uh, sometimes bed is being uh, cut and thrown out of the dorm, and which sometimes we experience problems such as the problems of where uh, the staff food club is being vandalized and where uh, we also experience, we also have problems regarding the gold, where the gold is being painted with, uh, with paint. So this is the problem that we need to solve by using money because we need to use our people to clean up, to repair these sort of damages. And this is why we use money and, and this is why, according to a report made by the school administrative board, we use around 13,000 ringgit for repairing these sort of damages only. And this is why, this is the third problem why we experience money crisis here in Star. And therefore, I hope you, uh, we, the committee board, I urge all of you to look in upon this matter and how we can solve this matter so that we can solve the monetary crisis of STAR. Thank you.